I'm Steve. And I'm Angela. And we are Midlife Cruising. We are coming to you live from the Villa V Odyssey and we're out on the promenade. And who's that behind us? I'm like, wait, who's behind us? <laughs> oh, it's the Regent Seven Seas cruise ship here in port today. Yes. So in today's video, uh, you know we went and spent nine days in Liverpool, so we'll continue that journey with you. We did some side trips, we went to Wales, we saw a few castles. Uh, one day we went to a town called Chester, so that will all be included in this video. And of course, as always, we have some footage here from the Villa V Odyssey. Yeah, we do. I have had a few comments lately about why I say hey friends, or the way I say hey friends. Um, it's just who I am. I've always said that. Uh, even when I walk in a room and greet my own husband, I say, hey, friend. It's just something we've always done. And obviously, in a million years, we don't mean it in any derogatory way. So it's almost comical to us. So I apologize if that does offend you. But it's not something I want to change. It's just, you know, we spent a lot of time in the Appalachian Mountains. And that's just what we say and do. Hey, friends. So I apologize if it bothers you, but I mean, I can't make everyone in the world happy. <laughs> so tell them about the interview. Okay. Oh, that's right. Uh, we were interviewed by Business Insider and they did a really nice article. Yeah, so go check that out. They have a Facebook page, a YouTube, and of course it's a pretty large media outlet. So we were honored um, that they took some time to interview us. They reached out and we said, sure, why not? Are there any other misconceptions you want to clear up? Yes, yes, of course. So a lot of people think that we're being scammed right now. And uh, let's try to clear that up. Right now, we're not paying a monthly fee. And Villa V has, is putting us up in a hotel every night here in Belfast while they sort the last certifications out. Uh, they shuttle us to the ship every morning and every evening well, they offer a shuttle we walk every morning for the exercise but they do offer a shuttle <laughs> and they feed us three meals a day here uh they have open bar here <laughs> yeah, um, open bar and so we i'm a bit perplexed on how at the moment we're getting scammed well but... i think from the outside looking in and basing it on past things that have happened with other ventures like this um, people are expecting the same here but this company already has purchased a ship they have crew here we get to watch them working on it every day um, yes they called us thinking we were going to set sail before and there have been delays but again during inspections even though they passed from the other company that owned it they passed the same exact inspection so now we have to bring it up to modern day codes and time so they're doing that safety is super important i'm okay with that is it ideal no but it's really just part of the adventure and we yes. hope to look back one day and say remember when people thought this or that or remember when we became residents of belfast i mean it's just all part of life and we just roll with the punches and it is really hard on some people and I understand that. I appreciate that. Um, and the fact that people are saying, how are you saying so positive? I mean, we do the best we can. We do, we do tend to stay positive. We do have a little vent session here and there with each other. But in the end, um, we have spoken personally with the owners, the founders, the people who've invested so much time and money and being here, seeing it, getting the updates, you just you get it and not being here and seeing it firsthand i can see why it may seem that way but it's okay we feel okay we feel confident um and in the end if it doesn't work out you know yes we would take a loss but it's part of the adventure and sometimes you just have to go for it well thanks for joining us today i hope you enjoy the video of the ship and our trips and stay tuned for more info at the end thanks for watching friends
Hey guys, let's tour the library and game and card room. It's really the quiet area, but it's early in the morning and we've beat everyone. So come on in, let's get a quick tour. library selection. We have a retired library on board, a librarian on board, so she will keep us all in check. Librarians are usually my favorite people, so we're excited about that. More over here. Chess, anyone? Cards all set up. More games down here. Oh, we already have a group working on puzzles. Look at this one. Woo, pretty, pretty. View to the outside and promenade right there. More games. This is lovely. They were using this for the war room. Oh, backgammon. I used to play backgammon with my mother all the time. This brings me back. We will be playing this for sure. See more games over here. This is lovely. Awesome. This room brings me lots of joy. I'm very excited. All right, well, we are getting back in our rental car. It looks amazing, it's brand new. But let's see if it fits five people. <laughs> <laughs> all That's right, we fair. are all in the car. We have the Canadian car. driving, Daryl. There he is. And in the back seat. Where, where are we? Oh, we're in a tunnel now. All right, so two Americans, three Americans, two Canadians. That's the maximum we can fit in the car like this. And surrounded by a bunch of Welsh. <laughs> Hey friends, you'll never guess where we are today. <laughs> where are we? Hold on. Conway Castle. <laughs> Come along. Hey friends. Hey friends. We are at Conway Castle in Wales. Wales. We left Liverpool for the day, took a ride up here with our friends, and they are right there. <laughs> Did you get dizzy? Yes. Not me, them, right? <laughs> and how was the drive up here? Scary. We were driving on the wrong side of the road. 
That's challenging. I'm glad it wasn't me behind the wheel. Lots I did of, scream a few times. Lots of roundabouts. Oh, one too many. Yes. Kudos to uh, Daryl. Daryl for getting here, getting us here alive. Yes. And well, come along with us and let's check this castle out. All right, let's go, France. King Edward I and his architect master James of St. George built both castle and walls in a barely believable four years between 1283 and 1287. That's oh, oh, oh. We got wow. action. We've seen some action. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I get nothing but what is going on? Those are big cows. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> is it a little wild? <laughs> hey friends, we have made it to the walled city of... I don't even want to butcher it. Those of you that know Welsh, let us know in the comments below how you can phonetically say this. Hey friends! Now we are in Carnarvon Castle, also in Wales, but in Carnarvon instead of Conway. Was that the name of the first castle? Conway, yes. yes. So now we're in Carnarvon. We are in the castle. land of uh, Welsh speaking, the Welsh language, and it is incredibly difficult. And my question is, do any of you, can any of you speak Welsh? <laughs> Because I am impressed if you if you can or do. Wow, what a language. Hey, good morning, friends. Where are we today? We are in Chester. In England, <laughs> outside of Liverpool, a quick train ride. It's August 16th, 2024. <laughs> and we took the train from Liverpool. And Steve wanted to stop here because he knows I have a thing for narrow boats. I narrow keep saying boats. next adventure. Yeah, that could be it. You've gone down this rabbit hole, haven't you? I have. I love me a good YouTube channel about narrow boats. So they are so cool. What an experience to live life on a narrow boat. Yeah, tell me more if you know anything about narrow boats or yes. live on one or did a vacay or holiday on one. How about let's go check out all that Chester has to offer? I see in the distance a really cool cathedral. Looks like a cathedral. Let's go, Fran. Come on.
place has been around for a minute. So we hope you enjoyed today's video and coming along. If there's something specific you want us to film here on board the Odyssey, please, of course, as always, comment below. Um, and we also notice when people do a comment and I respond, if you respond again, I have to go to a different tab, so those I don't always catch. So if there's something you really want to know and I didn't get back to it, make sure you make an original comment so I can see it, because sometimes doing the back to the replies we also keep finding these, uh, like once a week, we just check a help for review. And there's a strange section that YouTube pushes certain questions to. Um, and we're not sure why, because some of them are just fine. And YouTube also doesn't allow people to link other, videos. you know, articles or videos. They just don't allow links, so it won't uh, let it, those publish. So if you posted one and you don't see it, now you know why. Um, but thanks again for coming along. We truly appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Um, something else that Villa V just offered yesterday because, you know, we're still waiting. We think we're within a week, but they always want to be careful with saying that because you know how media and people take a word, oh, they said they were leaving and they didn't. So they're just being cautious as they should. Um, we do believe we're within a week to with the most of launch, but they've offered to send you to either Amsterdam, Brest, France, or Hamburg, 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 Germany, um, for a getaway, like flying you there, putting you up in a hotel. So they're giving people who are here options. People, some people choose to stay here in Belfast, but that's on them. So it is what it is. And I think this time we are gonna stick around because we just got back from a nine day trip. Um, we feel like this is home, so we like hanging out here. So <laughs> thanks again. Ah, uh, beautiful Belfast. <laughs> it is freezing right now, but we have short <laughs> sleeves on, so we're about to go back in. But thanks again so much for staying with, with us. We truly appreciate you. We've had so much love and support, and it means thank the you, world. Thank you, thank you, thank um, you. Oh, and all the coffees are just, uh, we're loving it, Thank you so it, much, everyone it. that's donated a coffee or a craft beer. <laughs> yeah, we've had that too. Um, I'll have Steve, Mr. Editor King here. He can throw those names up just to give you a shout out to show you how much we appreciate it. Thank you so much. Bye, friends. Bye, friends.